Hello, in this video, I will represent how to create a frequency distribution for two nominal data. We have collected data from people, their status and gender. This time, gender represented by two digits, one and zero. The digit one represent female and the digit zero represent male. Status is represented as well by two digits, one represents single and zero represent married. So let's start with creating the frequency distribution. First, we highlight the range of the raw data that we have collected. Then we click insert, pivot table from a table or a range. Excel will identify the table area and will ask us if to place the pivot table in a new worksheet. And we say, okay. In the pivot table tool, you can see that the two columns of the tables are appearing, the status and the gender. And what we do is we start by collecting um, or mouse over the status and pulling it to the row area. Excel recognize zero and one. If we want, we can actually change the labels. Okay, we can do it later. Um, let's go to gender, mouse over, pull it and drag it into the columns. So Excel recognize, uh, you can see here, they recognize zero and one. Okay, so if we don't remember which is one, we can go to the data dictionary in gender, one is female, zero is male. So then we can go back, one is female. So we can actually uh, click female and zero is male. So basically we updating um, the values in the table. Um, we can also do the same for status. We know one is single, so zero is um, married, so we can do um, married and single. So we updated basically the label instead of using zero and one. Now we want the frequency inside the content of the table. So what we do is either the status or the gender, it doesn't matter, both of them are categorical data. We collect one, mouse over, and we pull it, drop it into the values. Now, the problem with Excel is that Excel don't know to recognize that the number zero and one are categorical data and not just numbers. So Excel apply a summation on the content of the table, which is the wrong uh, application here. So we need to fix it. We'll click on the drop down menu. We choose values field setting and we change the function to count. We click OK, and now we have a frequency distribution with all the frequencies to um, show you the combination of married and single and male and female. In order to, for example, introduce this into a chart, we can click Insert and add the bar chart. And now we can see uh, the bar chart representing married and single and split to male and female. The beauty in the pivot table is that you can also switch uh, the direction. So you can actually pull the gender to the rows and pull the status to the columns. And now we switched and we see um, male and female and how they split with married and single status. So this completes the illustration of how to create a frequency distribution for two nominal data.